Going back to the figure, when external field rotates the electric dipole in such a way the electric dipole moment vector aligns with the electric field, apparently position of each charge changes as well. Recall that the energy associated with position is potential energy. Hence, when electric dipole rotates because external electric field applied work on it, its potential energy changes as well. From classical mechanics, we learned that work equals force times displacement. In rotational dynamics, rotational energy is equivalent to torque times angular displacement. This rotational energy is equivalent to the change in potential energy experienced by the dipole. Examining P cross E, if this is the electric field and this is the dipole moment vector, when dipole rotates, the angle between them decreases. Hence, the rotation results to a decreasing change in angle. Writing down the potential energy, we have torque multiplied to d theta. The magnitude of torque is Pe sine theta. In vector form, we have negative of dipole moment dotted to the external electric field. This expression gives us the potential energy associated when an electric dipole is situated in a region with electric field E. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and hit the notification bell button for awesome updates. Thank you for watching!